Today I want to show you one of our exciting new products. This is the HV950 B6.7 diesel engine trainer. And this is brand new, EPA 2017 emission standard. This has got all the latest and greatest technology that you need in your classroom. So what does that mean, EPA 2017 standard? That means that this engine has all the latest and greatest technology for engine performance. So we're running with a common rail system. We've got a cool DGR. We've got a variable geometry turbocharger. We've got an after treatment system that is all integrated with a diesel oxidation catalyst, selective catalytic reduction, the reductant agent or DEF fluid, the DPF, and all the sensors that go along with it. And many of these sensors are now directly on the CAN bus. So we can see if we look, we've got the yellow and green twisted pair. We've even got a terminating resistor right there on the exhaust system. Now, with this product, we've made it easy to access this for you and your students, and we can remove it from the bench using these quick connects. So, adding on to all of that technology, we're able to add teaching value. So, what we've got is a breakout box, the interface for the instructor and the students with all ISO symbols. We've got the ignition key, the master switch, and here's the most magical part of it, we have the fault box. So I'm gonna fire this up and we're gonna start playing a little bit with the fault box. So here we're firing up the engine. I'm gonna give it a couple shots of the accelerator pedal, just for fun. Now we're gonna turn on the PTO and adjust the idle speed up to about a thousand RPM. All right. Now using the fault box, we're gonna insert a couple different faults. Here we are with one of them, and we should be able to hear the difference in how the engine runs. You hear that? Now you can hear the variable geometry turbocharger change in pitch. Now we're gonna add a couple more faults to make it more difficult for your students. Start with one here. You can hear the engine's got a misfire. And now, one more fault. There we go. Good luck for your students. Using the pin identification chart for the breakout box, we're gonna pull a signal using the oscilloscope. So here, we've connected the oscilloscope to the breakout box. Let's fire up the engine and see what kind of pattern we can get. Here we can see an injector pattern on the oscilloscope. A Consolab engine bench like this one here can make your life easier as a teacher. Being on wheels, you can move it around the school. You can use it in your engine performance lab. You can bring it outside to do a proper regen. Live demos with your students. They can do exploratory learning. They can touch, feel, smell the difference as we incorporate different scenarios using the fault box. To find out more about our products, visit consolab.com or you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or LinkedIn. Thanks for watching.